a Dyson electric car by 2020 James Dyson must have cracked solid-state batteries James Dyson has announced Dyson will invest £2 billion build a battery electric car to launch by 2020. It will be radical and different. And expensive. James Dyson is far from a fool and having fought existing vested interests for years to bring his unique take on vacuum cleaners to the market he's now reaping the rewards. But despite the success, the wealth, the country is stayed in a satisfaction of having achieved more than most, James Dyson isn't resting on his laurels. Instead, he's building an electric car. Dyson is stumping up £2 billion to build the Dyson Mobile, and Sir James says it will be ready to hit the road on 2020, will be individual and not cheap. A bit like all Dyson products. It's a bold move from Dyson, and one that we feel must be based on a breakthrough from Dyson on solid-state batteries, otherwise it makes little sense to take the gamble and to join the plethora of companies, existing car makers and new technology companies, hoping for a slice of the biggest upheaval in cars since, well, since we first got cars. We know Toyota has made progress with solid-state batteries, and we also know Dyson has been working to achieve the same for some time. A couple of years ago Dyson gobbled up a battery startup called SAKTI3 for around £65 million which looked to have made significant progress on solid-state batteries, with a raft of patents to support it. But earlier this year Dyson seemed to have dropped the patents of SAKTI3, which could have meant they were not workable in the real world, or that Dyson had cracked it themselves with new patents superseding those owned by SATKI3. This announcement must mean Dyson has the technology cracked, and if it's on a par with what's expected from Toyota's solid state batteries, that should mean double the range, a fraction of the time to charge, and much cheaper to produce too. So we can probably look forward to a quirky Dyson electric car with a premium price tag and a range of over 600 miles from a single, much shorter charge. It's going to be interesting.